Oh, Tom's right here. We got some hellos. All right, then we're going to go ahead and start right now. The buzz immediately hopping in there with the dash attack, just controlling his ground. Good stuff right there. Nice little shring by the buzz. Keeping him in the air. I'm liking this. Ooh. All right. So the buzz actually uh, has not opted to do what I use. Oh, wow. He, is he not playing with customs? Or? This is this is how I knew for the buzz. He's actually not playing with the custom uh, Luma shot. He's playing the regular shots. Maybe he doesn't need it in this matchup, which I can respect. Uh, the buzz doing a really good job. Has not been hit yet. I mean, the, the spacing and the, and the lame game he's playing right now is really good. Got him stuck in between Rosa and Luma. And, and Luma just put in that work. Man, Lucario has not been... Oh, my God. Nice F smash by the buzz. Did not, was not able to finish, but keeping him off the stage. Lucario still has not been able to get a hit in. Ozzy just <laughs> landing on the ground. Still looking for a way to get in here right now. I like that attempt right there by the buzz. Bringing uh, Luma in and, add, and canceling that with a down smash. This is not the hero that we're usually ready to see. I, I'm not sure. If, uh, maybe Ozzy's trying to go for this... Uh, Wow. Okay, so if you, if you didn't know in this game, uh, grab break from deep. I like it. <laughs> deep Lucaria. Grabs break, but you, you take 3% of damage. So if uh, you grab someone and they hit you, um, the person who grabs takes 3 damage. Oh, no, the, the, the person who gets grabbed takes 3 damage. The person who, uh, who uh, grabbed takes uh, damage and knockback. So that's a, that's a little legit change, you know, kind of weakening grabs. Making uh making it a little harder to get him right there, but the buzz or the buzz taking that first stock mad easy right there. We still got 4:22 on the clock, and uh, it just seems like Ozzy just having a hard time really getting in for some reason though. That what I was about to say. It seems like he's staying very ground based in this matchup where he needs to be trying to get in. And I understand the ground game in this game is very good, but uh the way the buzz is playing is just, he's not allowing him to actually get in on him. the Rosa Luma player. Here we go. Nice stuff. Nice jabs. Okay. Once again, just using Luma to uh, kind of put uh, Ozan in the shield. I'm really respecting this gameplay from uh, DeBuzz right now. Okay, got him in the middle. And uh, Ozan just really, really not showing up right now. It's not looking too good for him. He's at 69%. Gets that scooped up yet again. He hasn't even really, like, he hasn't, not, not only has he not been able to hit Rosalina, but he hasn't really been hitting Luma either. And uh, Luma does have a, a bit of a like a bit of a life bar. So if you hit him enough, he doesn't even have to um, like fly off and hit the blast zone. He'll just disappear. It's only it's only gone for about seven seconds though, so it's kind of unfortunate for uh, people who are trying to use that strategy. Okay. All right, nice to be reverse right there by uh, uh, Ozzy trying to throw him off a little bit. He's got the full charge right here. Okay, finally getting some hits and he's got him off stage, but did not capitalize too well on that. The high recover. What? What was that? Did you see it? Like, he threw it, but it didn't seem like he hit anything. Like, it just disappeared and got to the front of him. Get the side B throw. Very strong right there. You know he's got that aura at a... Oh, no. All right, managed to make it uh, back to the stage. Good stuff. And now we got Blue Luma in the building. Um, DeBuzz finally losing his first Luma. Okay, so that was that was the chance for him to get the punish. Kind of uh, rolled his way out of there. Uh, look, Ozzy playing super cautious right now. All right, try to go for the hard read right there, the reverse side B. Ooh, wow, big damage coming from that. That now has a hitbox, and he scoops that up yet again, putting Luma in his face. Great coverage over there by Ozzy, but still not enough to finish. Gets that scooped up again. This is not looking good for Ozzy. Now that uh, that Galaxy thing, uh, just a little bit too much for him. And they're going to be up here. It is going to finish the game. Nice stuff. Gets both uh, hits from that. Gets the uh, Halo from Rosa and the hit from Luma. And that's going to be first game. Ozzy not really showing up right now. Not what we were expecting. Um, Ozzy definitely one of the one of the gods of Smash, as you uh, people like to call him. I mean, we he's on this poster right here. Like <laughs> we expect a lot more from right there. So maybe this is just is not his game. But going into game two, maybe he might switch up and get a uh, better grasp or just pick a better character. That matchup did not look too good. Uh, in his favor with with the way he was playing with Lucario, so, oh, so, oh, hopefully, hopefully we're not doing the bans from stream for getting two stocks. There's not enough stocks to do that. A oh, four stock is embarrassing. Two stock, that's that's possible, you know, especially with the rage factor in this game. Like you might get someone up to like 130 and they just never take a hit while doing mad damage. So, uh, I'm guessing we're trying to see what the counter pick is right now. Um, what stages are legal? Uh, oh wait, wait, I saw I saw the stage list legal. I know we have uh, Battlefield FD. Um, Yoshi's, and then uh, the that Pokemon Stadium. 
of the Pokemon Sage. Cannot remember the name of it. And all Omega Sages. And I don't know if this rule is uh, in, but I, I do like this rule. If you ban FD, you ban all the Omega Sages too. Uh, that's a good rule. That's a smart rule. Uh, so we should definitely go with that if we're not using it. Oh, JV3 is the ban. That's the ban. That's the new ban. JV3. If anyone gets JV3, you just gotta put. You gotta. You gotta stop. <laughs> like in this game, you just gotta. You gotta. You gotta quit. Long, long, long counter pick process right now. Man, my man is really thinking right now. He's like, man, I just got bodied. Like, <laughs> like, do I even really take it back to FD? To be honest, though, like the way we've been playing this game, uh, V as in VG Bootcamp, I really feel like this game was, uh, or the the DS version is very hard to play with on platforms because you can't do things uh, very effectively like platform dropping and just straight up uh, general movement. I feel like this game was almost balanced around FD, and so that's why FD seems to be the clear choice, and that's why that FD mode was uh, even thought of. Like, I think. It was that much, that much balance around uh, FD that they were like, hey, let's just make all FD. So just in case, you know, people get bored of the first one, we can just go somewhere else. And that was a good idea, too. I mean, even with FD mode, all those aren't exactly like FD because some have walls, some have a, a skinnier platform. And I, I, I like that change. So, All right, so it looks like we are going to Final Destination. That is counter pick. And did he switch characters or he's still playing Lucario? Uh, <laughs> all right, we, we can't see the characters yet, but I'm not sure if he switched. Um, but I would like to, you know, I I would think he would probably want to switch because that that was that was not a good display of uh, Lucario right there. I mean, he didn't even. It seemed like he was in a shield like the entire time, or he more so he was just scared. He wasn't wasn't really trying to be on the offensive or anything like that. And uh, oh, all right, going into game two, and he did not switch. Oz, I'm going to go ahead and switch over or uh, switch over to FD, but did not switch character. Let's see how this is going to work. All right. So I better start off right here. I actually get some damage in this time. And we do see the switch. I did not know we were allowed to counterpick uh, customs. So uh, that's the thing. He's counterpicking the customs right here. He's using the uh, single star shot as I was expecting him to do earlier. I'm just going to kind of lame him out, I guess. Try to zone him out, space him out, make sure he stays out. Uh, and when he gets close, probably just throw him away and go right back to it. Uh, that is this is a, this is actually probably a hit. Luma's best custom IMO, uh, the single star shot being able to go so far and very, being very quick. So Luma actually off the stage right now though. So Ozan now on the offensive, not liking how he's coming in through the air though. As you know, shield grabs in this game are very strong. Okay. Oh, nice jab right there, but Luma. I'm gonna go ahead and break that up. I like it. Ooh. Is he going to make it? Not going to make it. Not deep enough. Did not have enough damage. And that back air is going to seal the deal. He did not take that. Losing that first stock. Only 23% on the buzz. Looking real good. Okay. Nice stuff. Hey, just covering that option. Not allowing him to land on the stage. Uh, Ozan actually is doing a lot of air dodging into the stage. I hope he does know that it does have quite a bit of lag when you hit the stage with an air dodge. Um... I mean, even even the after an air dodge, you still hit the stage. There's a, a certain amount of time before uh, you can hit the stage neutrally and not uh, have a lot of lag on it. So, scooped up that singular tap. Why? <laughs> Just pop one face one good time. I'm gonna put him off stage right now. He's gonna go for another back air. Oh, actually goes for the ledge trump. Oh, almost finished him right there. That was nice. All right, going extra high with the recovery right there. The, uh, the benefit of playing Lucario. The more damage. Oh, it just walks up. Wow, 53. Did you see how far he got launched? This is powered up Lucario right here. Nice B reverse. Let's get, get scooped up, though. The back throw is going, just going to put him off stage. Kind of go ahead and finish this game real quick. Oh, good read. Good read. Saw the roll. And he does finish at 72. That is so good. Wow at that. Ozzy, maybe this is the strategy the whole time. He's like, I'm just gonna get on God mode right now. Oh, not God mode enough, and he is gonna take that easy game right there for the buzz. I mean, that 72% kill though, that was a little something, something. But uh, yeah, it's pretty good. I actually think uh, the boy Zach Zeeks is here. So we are gonna go on a break real quick though. So uh, stick tight. There's me run a couple commercials. Make sure you uh, stick around for some more hot Smash 4 action.